Here is how to install FFmpeg on Windows 10 and 11 in 3 minutes total. First, go onto the official FFmpeg website. Then scroll down and select the Windows Builds option. I'll select the first one. You'll notice two main zip packages that will interest you. The Essentials and the Full Package. I'll choose the Essentials, but you can choose anything you need for your purposes. If you're in doubt, pick the full version. Once the package finishes downloading, extract the files to your chosen location. In my case, I'll extract the files to my desktop. The files inside the folder should look like this. Select the extracted folder and change its name to FFmpeg, like this. Now you'll have to move this folder onto your main system drive. Drag and drop the FFmpeg folder onto your main system drive directory, like so. Now we'll have to add FFmpeg to path. Enter the system environment variables editor like this. Then click on the environment variables button. Now we will add the FFmpeg folder to system path so that we can access it using the command line. This step is very important. Click the edit button under the user variables and then click on new. Here you have to type the exact file path to the FFmpeg folder we just copied over to the C drive. Make sure that you don't make a mistake, otherwise it won't work. After you successfully finish the process, the FFmpeg folder should now be added to path. Close all these windows now and verify our installation. To do this, open up a system command prompt and type in ffmpeg, then press enter. After a few seconds, if you've done everything correctly, you should see that the tool is now accessible from the system terminal. That's it, a job well done.